Hello world, I am Victor and this is the first video of my channel. Today is the 27th of July 2022. I am starting a hashtag 100 days of hacking challenge and uh, I want to log it on YouTube uh, as a way to motivate myself and keep track of what I'm doing. Today I decided to just start without worrying too much about equipment and editing. Uh, during this challenge, I also want to learn about video creation, so we should be able to fix some of the issues in the following videos. Although I have some experience in the field of cybersecurity, I want to start from scratch and do as many online challenges as possible in the next 100 days. These will include uh, Try Hack Me Rooms, uh, Port Swigger Academy Labs, um, Hacker 101 uh, CTF and uh, also uh, security blue team courses and any other type of resources that might come up. I do have an online presence uh, on Twitter and I also have a website but they are really not popular. The Twitter has like 200-300 followers and the website had under 100 views yesterday. Uh, you will find the link to both in the description. Uh, we will see where this takes us in 100 days. In the next few minutes, I will walk you through my TriHackMe dashboard. Here it is. And show you the rooms that I already finished in my first day. I just started the TriHackMe, the free version, yesterday. We will also try to do one new room together today. Alright, let's go. Here in the top right corner, you see the users. After one day and just a few rooms, I'm already ranked uh, at 377,681 out of 1,243,000 something users. If I do a refresh, that's already changed the number of, number of users. People keep, keep um, creating accounts on TriHackMe for a very good reason. Um, this is the dashboard. You see that they are trying to get me to do a second day hacking streak. Um, I already answered like 40 questions. You get these notifications. My level is level 2, going to level 3. And I can invite friends. There is a skill matrix. You can resume learning or view paths. Um, all right, let's see what we did so far. We'll try to keep this video very short. Uh, these are the rooms that I did uh, yesterday. Um, this is the first room. Uh, it's called uh, Tutorial and it's uh, starting your first machine. Um, we need to start the machine and then um, with the free version, you get one hour of um, the attack box, but um, I already did the one hour for today, so we will use uh, the OpenVPN version. Let's, let's see how we did this. Use a VPN. Your machine has started. So what we are doing now is waiting for the IP address and let's read a bit the instructions. So for this room, it's very easy. We just need to start it and then go to the IP address and we will have the flag directly to put. The flag is also visible here if you are looking for that specifically. But again, it's just a tutorial, so you don't need to worry about it too much. Um, IP address will be shown in 22 seconds. Um, about this part with the um, OpenVPN, um, so if you use the attack box, it will just open on the right side of the screen and you have a um, virtual machine there and you can use it. But if you use the free version, you only get that for one hour. So for everything else, you need to use the VPN and use the tools on your computer. So this is the IP address. I already have the uh, VPN activated, so it should work directly. 
Here it is. The flag. Yay. And then we terminate the machine and move to the next room. Another room that I did is called Introductory Researching. And there's a lot of um, actual reading. And uh, for, for these types of questions, there is no flag. You just have to click here. It's already clicked. I can show you now. And this one is, for example, showing us how to do research. And then they ask a bunch of questions. And you can, of course, either look in the text above you or just Google it. And then you, you put it instead of a flag, it's an actual answer. And you click on the green button. I already got all of them already. So um, we can see that in a new room that we will do later. We also have vulnerability scanning. Again, you just Google for these. And it's interesting to read about them. But for the purpose of this exercise, you just learn how to use the, the website. Then for um, this one, manual pages, it talks about uh, manuals in uh, Linux. Linux. And then final thoughts. Again, you just click the green button. You need to click the button in order to, to complete it. And very important, you should read the text. Because even in these beginner rooms, there are some important tidbits that you might have missed until now. All right, another room that I did was this one called Starting Out in Cybersecurity. Well, again, where again you get some information about the jobs. And you have to answer, for example, what is the name of the career role that is legally employed to find vulnerabilities in applications. It's, well, it has this funny name called Penetration Tester. And then for defensive security, it's a security analyst. You need to write that in and hit correct. You can find the answers for these types of rooms in the um, text above. We're just going to close this. Next. Intro to offensive, offensive security, again, it has like three parts, hacking your first machine. Um, in order to do that, we actually need to start the machine. And the machine is initializing on the right. And this is actually the flag. But in order to get to the flag, they show us how to use GoBuster. Uh, GoBuster will find a directory name. You go to that directory name, which is actually called Bank Transfer. And then you will um, transfer yourself some money. And that will, when you go back to the dashboard, because you transfer that amount of money, you will get this flag, Bank Act. And you just hit correct answer and you're done. Let's see the machine a bit. Come on, attack box. So apparently 129,000 users are in this room now. Well, wow, that's impressive, I would say. I'm not sure if they are in this room right now. That, that would be weird. That's like 10% of the, of the, of all the people are here. Okay. Uh, let's try this command. So it's bank transfer. You go here. And you send from 2276. How do I know this? It's in the instructions. 28881. How much? 2000. 
yeah and it worked it's amazing making money congratulations you hacked the bank and this is the flag yeah yes uh, if you look in this uh, thing here on desktop you already have like the, the word list txt to the okay like 8000 words whatever uh, next text what is offensive security for this one you just click green button and the careers again the green button and room done uh, we did not terminate it let's hope this still works and then we have walking an application no sorry we didn't finish that yet we have what is dns so you need to write the correct answer you need to write a bunch of answers here from the you can find all of them in the text also the record record types this and for the practical part we of course use the website on the right meaning you click that button here view site and then you go you need to find the c name for shop you put the subdomain here and there it is shows that my shopify.com and then you need to find the text file the txt uh, value sorry and it's this one and then you need to find the m the numerical priority it's here and the a record ip address it's here it all worked brilliant <clears throat> now let's, let's see what we did here so we need to start the machine again so we will use a um, vpn Okay, I already have that. We need to wait uh, for the IP address. I was under the impression that I already finished this uh, room and I was planning to do a different one as a new room but I guess we can do this one uh, one of the, the ideas that I have is to keep this uh, whole thing short and not struggle with it too much otherwise I will uh, lose uh, interest I risk to lose interest or something and I will stop um, stop this or skip days or whatever so uh, now they told tell us to look in the source that's brilliant let's look in the source view source so they say we have a flag in the comment hmm. Do we? There's a flag in the HTML comment. It should be like that, ta -ta, and then these uh, cute brackets. Okay, so this is from the secret link, I guess. Oh, incorrect. So I guess we have to read the text. That's a bummer.
Okay, so we need to actually click on them and then we see the okay brilliant. Hey, hey, hey it worked. And then what about the comments so Ah, okay. So it was actually <coughs> a link in the comment, not the flag. Okay, directory listing. Ooh. So they say the images are in the same directory, which is assets. Hmm. Interesting. So what? Of course, there's a comment, <clears throat> there's a link to the framework. This is brilliant, guys, just brilliant. No? so it shows that I worked for two days that's it guys I'm not gonna finish the room right now I want to stop the video because it's also very long and uh, see you in the next one thank you